hello guys in this video we'll be discussing what actually is j password field so here you have in the palette you can just click it and drag it so the purpose of password field is very simple to understand it is something like some text which is typed within it should not be shown but at runtime that code should be shown so that is the purpose of the password field so i'll just write it here j password field like this so i'll just increase the size if possible to some 25 yeah this is password field so whatever you write within this will not be shown but at runtime you can get the data for example like password get text now here it is so i'll just run it so you can see whatever you're writing it's not showing here so i'll just click on get text so password field okay system dot or dot print enough password field dot get text right just run it so i'll write hello sodium so print it so you can see hello sodium has been printed so hello intact something like this something like that okay so this is the use of password field and i'm going to show you one more uh, simple uh, best thing if you want to see the password at the time of typing you can even use some specific thing so i'll just write here or you can write somewhere anywhere you wanted to write so you can write text show password like this so here you can write sorry I have the click on here so click on show password action perform so you can write here password if checkbox show chck show dot is selected then password field dot set echo character so you can write char of zero like this so you can see what happens now i'll just show sodium like this so if it is not selected else you can change it to star again actually like this oh sorry character must be specified and single dots right now we'll see what happens so sodium so hello like this if it is shown if it is clicked it is shown or else it's gone like that so i hope you enjoyed guys so don't forget to like and subscribe in the next video we'll be discussing some other topic thank you